Hey everybody, Crypto Mentor 99. How you doing? I am speechless. Okay, I'm almost speechless. Remember the other day when I started talking about the digital chamber of commerce that I knew zero about, zero about? Remember I showed you this? with the Token Alliance, whoops, Token Alliance, Chamber of Digital Commerce, and I put this 108 page document, and I get like 50 views, which is fine. My point is, I'm going after more newsworthy events of things other than Coindesk, Cointelegraph, or CryptoVest, you know what I'm saying? So I just saw a tweet, very innocent tweet, and I don't even know, my head is still spinning, I don't even know how to put it all together, but, man, there is so much I have to learn about the crypto space. So get a load of this. So I see a tweet, which I'm going to show you no, I'm not going to show you the tweet. I'm going to show you the uh, website or the article that I want to talk about. But look at all this. Who in the room here knows who the USOCC is? Said no one ever. I just found this out four minutes ago. Again, I'm still trying to put together the pieces. But this is important. The USOCC is and I will say it slowly, the Office of the Comptroller of the Currency ensures a safe and sound national banking system for all Americans. The Office of the Comptroller of the Currency. I'm 60 years old. I had no idea we had one in the United States. But get a load of this. Tweets from six hours ago. OCC begins accepting national bank charter applications from financial technology companies. So, no, 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 no. It's more than so, okay? The Office of the Comptroller of the Currency, so basically, and I'm going to show you the article. I'm going to link it below. This is huge. Every YouTube person should be, not should be reporting on it. This is so newsworthy. And not because I found it. I found it by mistake on Twitter like eight and a half minutes ago. So huge announcement by the OCC. So basically, fintech firms, potentially including crypto payment firms, now have the option to pursue a federal banking charter. What do you say, Crypto Meta 99? I said, fintech firms now have the option to pursue a federal banking charter as long as their capital and liquidity requirements are met. This, was a, this will allow them, I can't even talk. I'm so excited and shocked and dismayed. This will allow them to compete directly with traditional lenders and banks. Hello! Here's the link that you wanted for immediate release. Okay. Right here. OCC begins accepting national bank charter applications from financial technology companies. This is huge. This is huge. So take a look at this, and you may not understand all the gobbledygook, but it's called a level playing field. And I'm going to see how many... What would that stand for again? What, what did I say? O-S-U-S-O-C-C, -S Office of the Comptroller of the Currency. Man, I wish I was a president of that organization. So they ensure a safe and sound national banking system for all, and they just cracked the door. No, not cracked the door. They've opened the door.
for cryptocurrencies. I'll read it again. FinTech firms now have the option to pursue a federal banking charter as long as, it, as capital and liquidity requirements are met. Well, they're not going to try if those requirements aren't met. This will allow them to compete directly with traditional lenders and banks. Connect the dots. We need to start to connect the dots. This is unbelievable. That and the Chamber of Digital Commerce, unbelievable. Anyhow, Crypto Mentor 99, I'm in shock, and now I'm speechless. See you later. Love y'all. Bye.